We are T plus 40 seconds into the flight of Starship 33 Raptor engines powering the first stage. Power and telemetry nominal. We've heard power and telemetry nominal call out. We're heading downrange over the Gulf of Mexico. That call out tells us Starship is through the period of greatest stress on the way to space. Now the next major event is hot staging in just over 90 seconds from now. To get ready, the booster will shut down all but three of the Raptor engines. Flames holding the two stages together will release and the Starship second stage will ignite its engines. Starship will then separate from the super heavy booster and head to space. And at the same time, the three engines that are still firing on Super Heavy will flip the booster around. Ten more engines will ignite for the boost back burn, putting the first stage on path for a splashdown in the Gulf of Mexico. Incredible views of our super heavy booster. And as you can see, the super heavy booster has just experienced a rapid unscheduled disassembly. However, our ship is still underway with ship all avionics, six. Power and telemetry nominal. And we just heard there, ship avionics, power and telemetry nominal. All six engines are lit, as you can see from the GUI there at the bottom right hand side of your screen. We have lost the data from the second stage. We had heard a call out that we were internal guidance, which means we were getting near the end of the approximately six minute burn of Starship. But we haven't uh, gotten any more data since then. So we think we may have lost the second stage. So we would not be into coast phase. We wouldn't be able to come back in an hour or so uh, and possibly get ready for reentry. However, what we do know right now is we had an on-time launch at 7 o'clock. Uh, we got through the boats. First stage looked beautiful with 33 Raptor engines firing. We got the hot staging, you know, the thing that we really wanted to see and impressed. We saw the separation. We saw the flip maneuver. We saw the light up of the six Raptor engines on Starship and it headed away. Everything really looked good. But what we do believe right now is that the automated flight termination system on second stage appears to have triggered very late in the burn as we were headed downrange out over the Gulf of Mexico. But the real topping on the cake today, that successful liftoff, Kate, Shiva, the hot staging is just, yeah. just beautiful. Exactly what we were looking for. Yeah, ultimately, what Honestly, such an incredibly successful day, even though we did have um, a RUD or a rapid unscheduled disassembly of both the Super Heavy Booster and the ship, that's great. We got so much data and that will all help us to improve for our next flight. Of course, and that's why we flight test and you can bet that there's gonna be more to come. So we really do wanna thank you all for joining us. Of course, we wanna thank the people of Cameron County. We wanna thank all the federal agencies that have supported us for our, our tests. And, and of of course, a huge congratulations to the entire SpaceX team on getting through this flight test today. And I think with that, we're going to sign off from here in Hawthorne. Thanks so much for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.